Okay boys and girls, in this video I'm going to cover one of the most asked questions that I get. Um, I've just been going over my Discord channel and also the old uh, emails and I get this time and time again. How do I make money from creating bots and software? Okay, so before we get into the meat and potatoes of the video, I just want to do the usual plugs. If you haven't already done so, then get over to the botempire.com, check out all the content on there. Check out the bot creation course and all the other good stuff, the free videos. Uh, yeah, so get over there and check that out. If you haven't already done so as well, join us on Discord where we discuss making bots and other stuff. So make sure that you um, get over there and join us. All the links are in the description. Check them out after watching the video. Okay, with that being said, as I, as I mentioned at the start of the video, I wanted to talk about this question that I get over at least 20 times a week if not more um, normally from people that um, haven't started on their bot creation journey it's normally people that you know are looking into the future maybe they want to do it as a job or a way you know a way out of their current employment or you know people that have just started and wondering where it could lead to so i've scribbled down just a few ways that um, you can make money with bots now all these methods i've either used myself or people that I know have lots of these methods I've used when I was first getting started with uh, bots so I only want to share with you stuff that I know works or stuff that I've done myself okay so let's go from the top which is the most obvious one that I'm sure you've um, heard of of course but I just wanted to go into a bit of detail that detail with that and that is selling bots on sites and forums and stuff like that and it's a lot easier than what you probably think you're probably thinking well okay I can create a bot now how do I uh, make sales of it how am I gonna sell it well well my friend once you've got a bot made then I suggest that you make a, a website it this all depends on your budget as well I'm gonna tell you two ways two two methods that are quite good if you've got a little bit of money then I suggest that you make a site around your project product so just say it was a twitter bot you could you know twitterbot.com i'm sure that domain isn't for sale uh however get a domain that uh, relates to your product okay you could either build it on something like wordpress if you haven't got any html css skills okay you could pay somebody to to make it this again depends on your budget but get a website okay if you intend to make several several products then you could get a generic name like um, if you've got a name for a development company or something you could call your domain that so you're able to in the future offer uh, more than one of your bots okay so once you've got a site or a base to sell uh, your items your, your products sorry then there's there's numerous ways to tell people about what you've made okay some of the ideas is there's forums there's like black hat world you can build a reputation on there um, th there's lots of uh, smaller uh, black hat depending on what type of bot you built of course black hat world uh, what's that warrior forum that's not a black hat uh, site but there's lots and lots of forums that you can join and then you grow a reputation on there don't just go on there and try and sell straight away you have to you know uh, build a reputation on there and then all of them have got a way for you to sell normally through paying through a spot an advert on their site and you will attract buyers there's it, it's a surefire way that you will the other way that you can do things it's uh, a lot slower but if you're on a budget it works is for you to um, join Facebook groups reddit groups groups that are relevant and forums that are relevant to the product that you're selling obviously and then slowly work into conversations with people about your bot get people over to the site and and then from there you can make sa sales there's all different forums that allow you to advertise so i'm just going from one to the other with it depending on your budget the other way that you can do things is run ads uh, to your site now before you start thinking that you need a ten thousand dollar budget just to get off the, off the ground that's just not true at all you can uh, run ads on bing that are ultra cheap and bing are really lenient on what you can advertise okay uh, you can get it's possible to get five cent clicks on bing okay 
Um, this, this video isn't to go over um, how to advertise, it's just giving you ideas and options. Um, the other thing is Facebook ads as well, they don't have to be expensive if you target correctly. Um, grow a page on Facebook, grow, grow a following on Twitter. Now the other thing you can do as you get better with creating bots to sell your bots is to use platforms like Facebook and Twitter. Um, in fact, I'll, I'll give you a little story um, about how one of the first things that I started doing is that I, I developed um, a piece of software and to sell it, I went on, sorry, it wasn't a piece of software. It was um, selling leads to somebody. In fact, someone that I know, so it was more of a friend uh, for his web design agency. So what I did, I created a bot that waited for people to mention the words uh, my new website or check out my website on Twitter and it would within a minute of them posting that it would uh, write to them a, a uh, non spammy message uh, just offering uh, services to them such as uh, redesign of their website plugins and SEO because if if the person's just got um, a new a new website uh, it might it doesn't necessarily look mean it looks um, professional or the best so the idea behind it was that uh, the message goes out we offer um, SEO uh, redesigns plugin there was plugins to make the websites faster etc etc so it was a great way to um, sell a service so that's covered more in the lead generation section that we'll talk about later so but my point is my point is you can use your own bots to attract uh, leads. How about um, adding people, uh, designing a bot that adds people on your Twitter, your Facebook, and your Instagram that are relevant to the bot that you want to sell, and then sending them a DM. It's a great way to get off the ground. So we have um, selling your bots on forums. We have running ads to a website or pages you have, and then also using bots to create leads for your own products. Okay. Another way to make money with um, your newfound bot skills is local clients. Okay, you can create your own products that have been created before, um, and then sell them for a premium to um, local clients. For instance, creating a bot that um, does a person's social media posts for them and adds people that are in their local area. Okay, I'm, I'm sure it's done, but being done before there's programs already out there but it's not yours and it hasn't got your brand on so you could easily create something that simply uh, goes out to um, local news sites uh, local news accounts on Twitter and Instagram and start adding people that are local to your clients um, area so that they follow back and your client sees a lot of new people in his area um, and then maybe the software can auto tweet or um, send out messages on Instagram and Facebook and do all that for him. That's just one idea of many uh, that you could do. Uh, also content upload for his website so that you could automatically upload the content he's got. There's so many things that you can repurpose that have already been done that make your own version of the uh, software and sell it locally. Okay, It's not difficult to um, email without being spammy okay uh, finding the email addresses of the local businesses in your area or it doesn't even have to be your area but you could start off small in your own area and tell them about the product and even give them a free trial okay um, again an another way to there's so many ways but you don't even have to do this locally you could have a piece of software that um, automatically um, adds people relevant to a client's niche you could give them the software on a two-week trial and it, it'd be easy to give away trials. Everyone's willing to test out your software if it gets them sales and clients. Another idea, one that I've used myself, is account creation. Okay, uh, Accounts go for a lot of money, especially if they're aged and they have followers or um, you know they have karma points if it's on Reddit. They can go for a lot of money. So if you have, and this is just an idea way back in the day it's not something I, I do at all now or associated with but um, you can make make accounts uh, with bots easy and then you can age them and you can uh, make them add people so that when you come to uh, give them to someone else they uh, have good stats and a following and as I say they're, they're worth a lot of money so you could um, 
do that all day long and you can sell these accounts on their sites like hack forums and black hat world and all these places that you can uh, sell them and the good thing about doing something like that is that once you have a customer and you have their trust um, and they see that you do offer the goods properly uh, then uh, there's no reason you won't have a repeat customer again and again and again okay um, run uh, the next one is run a service with your created bots so instead of like here we said about selling your bots you could actually run services for people like running their social media with bots like generating leads like I, I told you about the guy that I generated um, kind of SEO slash website development plugin leads for him there's no reason you can't do the same there's probably 10 million different affiliate programs out there so look for a program that's looking for leads and tell them that you generate your um, leads via social media okay and then you could easily do that all again you can instead of doing this locally you could do this globally or nationally at least uh, run a service you could have a bot that um, adds people to Twitter let's just say you had a Twitter bot adds local people to their account and uploads content for them would you like to try it out for two weeks for free and then you could run it on a VPS and there you go that's a great way to get clients especially if you can offer some form of trial or show them that you are the real deal okay um, and there's plenty of services you could offer I mean there's just myriads this is just a quick video to start giving you ideas um, depending on the feedback on discord and uh, email I will uh, see if you know there's warrant for another video to go deeper into these methods and then the last one I want to go over if you're using a program like browser automation studio you can do things like really deep things I mean you can use API's with it because you can do requests and stuff it's for people that know um, a little bit more than the basics but you can uh, generate sites and you can sell them you could there's so many things any site that you see that has an API you can use so there's no reason there's lots of um, API's that provide content so um, people think that uh, systems like browser automation studio can only do stuff that um, is desktop based you know like interact with uh, Twitter and all, all the sites are online but there's a lot more to it than that because you can uh, use requests and stuff and work with API's um, so you can work with data that's you know provided um, and then you could use that data to upload to websites etc so you could and one thing that um, I did for a while was generate websites with uh, content that was uh, from the web and it, it ranked for lots of different uh, long tail keywords um, yeah there's different different methods but what I'm trying to uh, my point is with this uh, site generation and using API's there is a myriad of things that you can do with browser automation studio and if you're just programming in general uh, it, this is really a really good tip to think outside of the box and maybe you know uh, maybe you're not using browser automation studio but you can do this with um, if you're using a programming language or maybe a, a bot chief or xenopost or exact etc okay so i hope that's given you a few ideas and the main thing that i want to want you to take away from this if you're getting into designing bots or you've been at it a little while but you're wondering if there's kind of a way that you can make either some side money maybe a side hustle or you're thinking about uh, wanting to do it full time there is plenty of opportunities uh, the other option that I haven't listed on here hopefully this has already got your mind going with how many options there are you can all you can always uh, message people speak to businesses if they need kind of an app or a bot designed which I know comes under selling bots but just the, um, there's a lot of freelancer sites as well that are looking for bots um, so you know it, the possibilities are endless okay guys I'm gonna leave it there I've um, rabbited on enough I think um, I think that's giving you some value for money which is free <laughs> okay and giving you some ideas I hope that helps anyone that's thinking into getting into the bot creation space there is a lot a lot of people that want uh, bots and software designed either for their business or if you can show them that you have a, a piece of software that can do something that's beneficial to their business and you can sh um, offer them a trial or at least show them 
that um, it, it does stuff and it's going to be of value to them, I can assure you that you'll be making a lot of money, dollar wonga. Okay, guys, um, please leave your comments below. If you haven't already subscribed and you're watching your videos, please do so. It's really helpful to where we're trying to get to. And make sure you come and chat to us in the Discord. All right, guys, peace.